guys andrew here and welcome back to Drew tutorial and in this video i'm going to show you how to fix two finger scrolling not working on your windows 10 or even your windows 11 pc now i'm currently using a windows 11 pc so i'm going to show you how to fix this here but as i said the steps works just the same for your windows 10 as well before we jump in guys would you mind take a moment to give this video a like and hit that subscribe button because this will let me know that you found value within this video and on top of that, the biggest benefit is that you'll never miss out when I release future videos just like this one. Now, let's continue. So, the first thing you want to do, guys, is to right-click on your taskbar and click on Settings here. And then from here, on the left-hand side, click on Accessibility. From here, you want to scroll all the way down and click on Mouse. Now, you have two options. You can click on Mouse Pointer. And then from there, you will be able to find touchpad or you can simply click on mouse here and you'll be able to find. So let's use the first option. And from here, you will scroll down to where you'll find touchpad. So click on the touchpad. And what you want to know, do know, guys, where you have the touchpad, you want to ensure that this is enabled, right? So if it's not enabled, then you will not be able to do it. That's first and foremost. But if it's enabled, go ahead and click the little drop down here and ensure that leave touchpad on when a mouse is connected so you want to ensure that this is enabled and in case this is on and it's still having issues you can uncheck it and do a reset it's going to do a reset and it will be like that now the next thing you want to do is scroll on a bit to where you have the scroll and zoom so you want to expand this and just ensure that both of these are currently selected so you have the drug tool finger to scroll ensure that this is checked and not unchecked like that so make sure it's checked and you want to ensure, I guess any one of these is pretty much fine. It's just the order of how to do the scrolls, right? So you can have it to scroll up or you can have it to scroll down. It's your personal preference. You can leave it at which one. But ensure that both of these are checked, pinch to zoom and also two finger to scroll. So ensure that this is working fine and there is no issue there. Now from here now guys, if you're still having issues here, go ahead and restart the computer. If there is no pro, if the issue persists, Try in the control panel. So I'm going to simply click the Windows key here and type in control panel here on my computer. Click on that. And then you want to go ahead and you want to look for a mouse. So click on mouse. Now from here, click on pointers and you want to see what kind of scheme is currently selected. Now by default, it should set to none. So if something else is selected, you want to change it to none and then click apply, restart your computer, try again. The other option you can choose that is also fine is if you click the drop down, you want to choose the option that says Windows default system scheme. So select this one, click on apply and see if that works. If not, restart the computer and try again. Now, if you're still having issues, guys, you might want to go ahead and try your touchpad driver. So you can always right click on the taskbar and go to device manager. From here, you'll be able to find your mouse. And as you can see, there's an option that says mice and other pointing devices. So you can expand that and you can see if you have issues. Now, what I suggest if you have any exclamation or question mark there, you might want to try to install those drivers. You can try to disable and enable those. You can, as I said, update these drivers as well. So you can click update and you can search automatically or you can browse for those different drivers and you can choose the option to let me pick and you can choose the options that you have here and try to install. You can also check online for your computer provider. So you can look for the most driver for your computer. If you don't know the brand of the computer or the model of your computer to search for the driver, you can easily find that. So all you have to do, click the Windows key on your keyboard again, type in system and you will find system information. Click on that. And from here, you can find on the system model, the type of computer, the computer name, and you can also see the system type as well. So you can take the computer name, head over to Google and search for your computer drivers. So you can type in your computer name plus drivers or your computer name and most drivers. And you can search for the driver from the manufacturer website and try to install the drivers from there and try again. Basically check the steps as I showed you, restart your computer afterwards and try again to see if that fixed the issue. Here you have it guys. I really hope you found value within this video. And if you do, don't forget to take a moment to give this video a like and hit that subscribe button so that you'll never miss out when I release future videos just like this one. Thank you guys for watching and see you next time.